Hello. Here we are. Episode 11, maybe? Let me get my horse. Oh, that's right. Lead the way. He said the place is just northwest of here. Me? You're the one who's been out gallivanting around here. That's what you call me. Gallivanting. La 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 la. Could have played that better, couldn't you? Thought you wanted me here to show some strong arm. That's usually how it goes. Yes, but you know how this works. Huh? Come on, Jose. That feather's a joke. And that's why he's perfect. He won't cause us any problems. <sighs> nice. A safe spot to fence wagons and coaches. That's easy money for us. I guess you're right. Come on, it's not like he's asking us to rob a bank. If the two of us can't steal a stagecoach from Seamus' old crooked cousin by marriage, we should hang up our hats now. So, what's the story with that Emerald Ranch? You find out anything else? A little. Owner's a nasty type by all accounts. Hey, let's keep it down now. We must be close. Arthur. That must be the place up ahead. We should go on foot from here. Let's see what we're dealing with. Come on. There's the house. I see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. Okay, let's take a quick look at the place. can do it now. I'll head over, distract him by putting on a little show while you sneak into the house, find what you can, then get the stagecoach. Or wait until nightfall. Sneak in, then I'll get the coach. You can try the house. What do you think? Let's wait. Okay, let's go. Sure. You go into the house. I'll go find this wagon. Maybe take a peek through the windows before you go in. Make sure it's all quiet. I'm just going to go through the front door. Hello? Okay. So, first place to check. Chimney. Oh, 
damn. Imagine finding $150 back back in these days. That's like enough for a house. I want some whiskey. Bourbon. Come on. Take the money. Take the money. Come on. Come on. I think I took it. Uh, come on, take the money. This place is rigged. I don't even want to find anything in the drawers. That's what I thought. Yeah, well, let me take any more. Yeah, I guess we might need to sell. Why do you call this upstairs? It's like nothing. Oh my god. Whatever. Hard day's work. Done in less than an hour. Slow down. Oh, one piece. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Hey, I am. Burn out the horses. Eh, maybe I don't care.
Nice work, Jose. It's mostly art. Like I said, coarse, but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Nah, I'll catch up with you later. Okay. Stay out of trouble. Oh, I forgot. How do I, uh... Fast travel? Not fast travel, but, you know, speed up time. Um... Yeah, let's do them. <laughs> Who's out there? Oops. Bounty hunters. <laughs> Should I kill them all? You're gonna give me trouble. Man. I wonder if I can just save. Oh, I got him. Ooh. Got him good. <laughs> you want a piece of me? This is like a. Well, I forgot what the horse thing is called, where you like. Justing? It's like called like. Justing or something. Oh, my nose. I'm glad the place didn't go into lockdown. Don't you even think about raising a hand to me again. Okay. Look at all this stuff. Bring me. I have to go here. John Marston. John Marston.
Oh man. Oh shit. Oof. Clean. Yeah, they're kind of far behind. seem in a good mood? I am, son. I am. Let's have some fun. Tonight. Let's enjoy ourselves. Are we having a party? Maybe. Just a little one. Gray? Even you, Arthur. Even you. Mr. McGuire is back. So come on. Here we go. Let's have ourselves a party. We're back home now. So everything's going to be okay. Uncle Sean is back. And don't you worry, Miss Grimshaw, you old crone. You I'll keep them girls in line. If I you have to whip them, I will. And don't you worry, Mr. Pearson, you drunk old shitbag. It'll be nothing but the, the finest no game in the fire. pot. Now, Deadly Maguire's back. <laughs> and don't worry about nothing, Mrs. Grimshaw. We'll have this camp running like clockwork. I love you, bastards. <laughs> Have fun. Have lots of fun. <laughs> Can we drink now, please? Uh-oh, here comes trouble. I just can't get rid of you, can I? Hey, mind if I join you fine folks? I suppose. You're looking lovely as ever. If I may say so. Oh, stop it. Imagine riding with him all the way from Blackwater to here. This is stupid. So, what now? Come on. How about a song? <laughs> He'll be drinking till dawn now, I bet. Hey, oh, let him Listen, have some my fun. friend. <laughs> He's been through Do a lot. You know the Louisville I thought you Irish enjoyed a party, Molly. Oh, yeah, I'm enjoying it. Well, I just don't need to fall over drunk with the rest <laughs> yeah, of the <laughs>
You, <laughs> you old bastard. <laughs> and I missed a good excuse to celebrate. <laughs> Me and you never need one of those, Uncle. I didn't think we was going to see you again. Try to take more than that to take down Sean as well. Look at me. With the bell of the ball. <laughs> Stop it, you. you're angry and sad. Well, what you think of me? <laughs> sad in a good way, like a romantic poet. Well, that's about all I can muster. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Morgan.
father come in angrily said, now you have lost your maiden head. Pack your bag and coat tags too. Make your living off the ring dang do, the ring dang do. Now what is that? It's soft and round like a pussy cat. Got a hole in the middle and split in two. That's what you call the ring dang do. She went off to be a whore. Hung this sign upon her door. A dollar each and three for two. Take your pack and ring dang do. <laughs> you dirty man. Yes. Fun, Arthur. Sure. You don't look like so much fun, boy. Pat your fucking hair down like a man. <laughs> Hell, even all them strokes is more of a laugh than you, boy. Oh, thank you, kid. I, I, I'm sorry, Arthur. I, I, I didn't mean it. It's just because I care. It's because I love you, Arthur. Really, it is. <laughs> Sean. Can I get you anything? A drink? I'm fine. Well, you let us know. I'm trying to sleep here. Well, we got him. You did very Stop well. Stop messing with me. into a, a village in the trees. Uh, they'd never seen a white man before, and as luck would have it, they, they had a witch doctor made a prophecy that a god would turn up floating on the river, white as a cloud. 
<laughs> so they made me a god. <laughs> and it was fun for a few weeks. Uh, well, then they tried to marry me off to the chief's daughter. Either that or uh, sacrifice me to another god. <laughs> When I said, I'm not the marrying kind, <sighs> they wanted to kill me and feed me to their pigs. <laughs> well, I ran away and, well, I spent weeks in the jungle, <laughs> gorging okay. off giant I'll cockroaches. Oh, God. True story. I promise you. For you it has caused me to roam. I'm a rabble rouser, and Dixie is my home. Jackie Diamonds, Jackie Diamonds, I know you of old. You robbed my poor pockets of silver and gold. Oh, whiskey, you villain, you've been my downfall. You've kicked me, you've cuffed me, and caused me to brawl. My foot's in a stirrup, my bridle's in my hand. I'm leaving sweet Molly the fairest in the land. Her parents don't like me, they say I'm too poor. They say I'm unworthy to enter her door. They say I drink whiskey, my money's my own. And them that don't like me can leave me alone. I'll eat when I'm hungry, I'll, I'll drink, drink when, when I'm dry. dry. And when I get thirsty, I lay down and cry. <laughs> it's beefsteak when, when I'm hungry, and whiskey when, when I'm dry. dry. Greenbacks when, when I'm hard up, and hell when, when I die. die. Yeah. Rye, rye whiskey, whiskey rye, rye whiskey, rye whiskey, rye whiskey, rye whiskey I cry. cry. If, if I don't get, get rye, rye whiskey, whiskey, I surely will die. die. Floor. I've rambled and trampled this wide world around, raising hell with the gang. That's where I am found. It's with these gunslingers, dear Molly, I roam. I'm a rabble rouser, and this is my home. If the ocean were whiskey and I were a duck, quack, quack. I'd dive to the bottom. And get one, one sweet sup. Sup. But the ocean ain't whiskey and I ain't no duck. So I'll play Jack of Diamonds and then we'll get drunk. Oh baby, oh baby, I've told you before. Do make me a pallet, I'll lie on the floor. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
the soul of a neat Irish man. He loves all that's lovely, he loves all that he can. With his sprig of shillelagh and shamrock so green. His heart is good humour, is honest and sound. No malice or hatred is there to be found. He cuts and he marries. He drinks and he Who fights. did you call a goddamn For love or for love for in that he delights Shut with his sprig of shillelagh and shamrock so green. Where had the luck to sing Donnybrook fair? An Irishman in all his glory is there with a sprig of shillelagh and shamrock so green. <laughs> his clothes spick and span new without air a speck. And he burst alone a tight knee round his neck. <laughs> He goes to a tent and he spends half a crown. He meets with a friend and for love knocks him down. With his sprig of shillelagh and shamrock so green. <laughs> that evening returning as homeward he goes. His heart soft with whiskey, his head soft with blows. With his sprig of shillelagh. The shamrock so green. He meets with his Sheila, who's blushing a smile. Cries, get your gun, pa. You can sense all the while. <laughs> with your sprig of shillelagh and shamrock so green. I knew you boys would come for me. I knew it. I love you, Arthur Morgan. <laughs> right. Damn it, Sean. You, Susan. How's it going? Sounds good. Hang in there. 
morning, I say.